Welcome to Oracle Application Training Session. Today we are going to see the unit of measurement, I mean the transaction unit of measurement and the primary unit of measurement, how it is interlinked and how it is reflected, sort of. So basically we are seeing the on hand quantity for bread one for the V1 organization and we see a total of 300 dozens and it's in two sub inventories 100 and then in the second one storage there are 200 dozens totally there are 300 dozens now we are going to do a miscellaneous reset and going to raise the stock for this item bread one in a, another sub inventory and this time we are going to increase it by the unit of measurement each and not by dozen each we have a intra class conversion so one dozen means 13 pieces or 13 each so let's do a miscellaneous result for 2600 units and the, uni the unit of measurement is each so when it converts and stores it should be stocking it up as dozens because that is the primary unit of measurement for this particular item so we are querying on the on hand quantity item is bread one and clicking on the find there we see on hand quantity for REM SI and the primary unit of measurement is dozen and the primary quantity is 200 the 2600 whatever we entered with the unit of measurement each that has been converted to dozen and the conversion rate is one dozen is equal to 13 each so baker's dozen basically consists of 13 pieces and that's what we have tried to create in this particular session and the example is should be uh, clear how a yeah, transaction quantity con is get converted to primary quantity uh, unit of measurement in the on hand quantity screen thank you